Welcome back everybody to another video here to bring you a quick another thoughts video on the Lego Technic 2020 sets. Uh, I'm gonna get them on promobricks.com right now. Uh, they revealed all these sets um, over the past couple days. And uh, yeah, Technic is definitely another one of those themes that I do like most of the time. I don't have too many Technic sets, but I do have one coming in the mail now and I do have uh, a couple of my backlog and I do have intentions on getting more uh, down the line. I tend to like the bigger Technic sets more, but I will definitely give my thoughts on these smaller ones. So first one right here is 42101, the buggy. Uh, again, I'm not the biggest fan of some of these weird Technic sets. You guys will probably be able to tell I'm really just a fan of, you know, sports cars and like supercars in Technic form. Uh, but there are a couple other things that I am fans of, but uh, the buggy's kind of cool. I believe it's going to be $10, a couple images of it right here. Nothing crazy. Yep, it should be $10. So, not too bad, nothing I'll pick up though. And then same with the 42102, the Mini Class Exeron, I believe that's how you say it. A little tractor right here, a little uh, something something on the farm. Not sure exactly what this would be. Um, looks like something, uh, I mean, is, is it a crop cutter kind of thing? Uh, you know, like for corn and stuff like that? I'm not sure, but uh, it's not too bad. I mean, it, realistically, I do like this better than the buggy above. So if I were to choose one, I would probably choose this one, but again, another little $10 set, not the biggest fan of it. Moving on to the Dragster, this is definitely one of those Technic sets that's just kind of awkward and just not a fan of it at all. Um, I believe this is going to be $25. It's actually just $20, so Dragster, not going to be picking that one up at all. Uh, race truck, uh, again, just not a fan, not a big fan of trucks, um, so not going to be picking up this one right here, but yeah, so there's that. Uh, that looks like it'll be $40. Um, we're actually, let's see, what, what, oh, $20, oh, the price is above, let's, yeah, $20 or $20, okay, okay, I swear this one's different than the Star Wars one and stuff like that, but moving on to the Catamarans at number 42105, uh, this one, I did want the one from a couple of years ago, so I'll probably end up picking up this one, uh, if I can find it on sale a little bit, it looks like it's gonna be $40, so not too bad, and then moving on to this one, the Stunt Show Truck and Bike, not, not for me at all. 50 euros seems like a pretty good deal, though, honestly, for two vehicles like that and the little ramp. So I think 50 euros or $50 is a good price. Uh, 610 pieces, that looks like it's going to be a good deal, but just not for me. Then moving on to the uh, mobile crane right here. Uh, this is going to be $100, about 1,300 pieces. Not the biggest fan of this either. Not a huge construction worker guy, you know, like kind of all the sets that they come out for that. But then I believe the last set right here is going to be the number one. Yep, the uh, Technic App Control Top Gear Rally Car, uh, one hundred and thirty dollars, so it should be around or one hundred and thirty euros, so it should be around one twenty to one fifty in the U.S. Hopefully on the lower end there. For four hundred sixty three pieces, I get all the technology in there is what makes that set pricey, but I think they could have found a way to cap it off at a hundred. I just think anything above a hundred for that amount of pieces, and with the car not being like super super cool in my opinion i mean if it was like a mclaren or a lamborghini or something like that you know i feel like a lot more people would want it uh, including myself but for what it is right here um i will pick it up eventually i do like the car i do like how it looks i like the concept of it i definitely want to give it a shot but hopefully i can get it for under 100 at some point um because there's a lot of other sets i'd rather get you know for my 130 dollars you know including like the um the Technic Porsche, the Stranger Things house, Dark Knight Tumblr and stuff like that, all for like kind of that, you know, high 100 uh, price tag right there. So there's that, but I, and I understand that probably the licensing with the top gear, I mean, cost me quite a lot of money as well. So can't really fault them too much on that, but I wish they would have capped it off at about 100. But yeah, guys, there's all my thoughts on the 2020 Technic sets. Not too bad of a wave. Again, there's about two of them I like. So not too crazy of a wave for me, but yeah, leave your thoughts down below, guys. I'll thank you guys all for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe. Stay tuned for it to you guys later. 5% off on your next LEGO purchase. Be sure to use code LIFEBRICK. Uh, that's capital L-I-F-E BRICK at republicbricks.com for 5% off your next order. We'll pretty much pay for your shipping or get you a couple dollars off. They sell old LEGO minifigures, sets, mystery boxes, and more. I've got a couple of videos on my channel uh, showing the products. Uh, so be sure to use code LIFEBRICK on your next order for 5% uh, for off.